ಮುಂದೆ ಇಲ್ಲೇ ಇದೆ ಮುಂದೆನೇ ಇದೆ ಇಲ್ಲೇ ಇಲ್ಲೇ ಇದೆ ರೋಡ್ ಮಧ್ಯೆಯಲ್ಲೇ ಇದೆ as i'm new to vlogging i'm still figuring out the best settings for the gopro so bear with the quality and the shaky image it was a nice cloudy night but the weather was cool with an earthen fragrance in the air that lingers while the ground below is slowly drying up after rains an occasional droplet of water would drip from the trees above and hit the visor breaking the monotony of the wind noise vasuli and i were riding through a dense forest the grip levels were moderate as the roads were still moist but vasuli was in his element i was riding very carefully around the bends in the road because i did not know what i would find in the darkness of the night and i was glad that the tarmac was in great condition this meant that i could look around to spot animals rather than keep my entire focus on the road to negotiate through broken patches riding forest and night these are my three favorite ingredients for creating a thrilling experience the idea of me riding through forest is to spot animals without disturbing their habitat Of course the animals will not come to places of human civilization that is why we have to go to the forest to see them however we have to practice utmost caution and be prepared to face any situation which can spring up unexpectedly but even before that we need to keep in mind that we are entering their territory so it is very important that we respect their boundaries and do not tease them or try any stunts to get better camera footage for more likes it takes just a moment for things to take unexpected turns and finding help in these places can be very challenging night or day but remember if an animal attacks and harms you it is only and only your fault you are in its territory that too uninvited A lot of you are going to ask me what auxiliary lights I am using. Click on the i button above to watch the details of the aux lights. While aux lights are great for illuminating the road ahead, they can also cause massive disturbance to oncoming traffic. I request everyone watching this video to use their aux lights responsibly. Remember, aux lights are not for showing off. They are made for your safety, so use them wisely.
I managed to spot a couple of wild pigs, few rabbits, a beautiful wine snake, lots of rats, and a bunch of spotted deer. One bugger in that bunch was particularly brave. Usually spotted deer run in the opposite direction of anything that approaches them. This fellow was slowly stepping towards me. Anyway, I had no intention of petting him, so I moved on. Finally, I found some real danger on the road, a full-grown lone tusker. The elephant had his back towards me, but within a split second, he turned and started charging towards me. Notice that from the center of the road, I moved to the extreme left and just gunned Vasuli to avoid getting listed on the obituary column in the next day's newspaper. The camera can capture only so much. Our eyes, however, see a lot more. No sooner than I had passed the elephant, he was already in the middle of the road, which I could notice due to the ambient light. These current age mammoths are fast, I tell you. Anyway, I was happy to have spotted some animals in the wild. One such mission accomplished. Once again, be responsible and ride safe.